Hi, and thanks for choosing Pebblehost. Today, I'm gonna to show you how you can set up Cloudflare for your domain. So let's get right into it. So first of all, you want to come to cloudflare.com. Once you've done that, you don't want to click sign up, and then of course, enter your email and create a password. Once you've done that, you can then click create account, and there we go. So we're now in Cloudflare's main menu. Then in the top, we want to click add site. Once we're on here, we then want to put in our domain. So I've put my domain and we'll click add site. And then once you've done that, you then want to click the free plan. So click get started. Once you're on this page, you then want to delete any DNS records that you do have. Most of the time, these are the default ones from your domain registrar. And they don't do anything useful, so you can simply just remove them all. So we'll click delete, and we're going to do this for every single one. On these ones, it's a bit different. We'll click edit, and then delete. Once we've done that, we'll then click continue, and then we'll click confirm. Once you go through all those steps, it should take you to this page. Next, we want to change our name servers on our DNS registrar. So of course, this will depend on the registrar that you use. And my domain uses Namecheap. All right, so we're now on our Namecheap dashboard. Once we're on here, we then want to find our domain and then go to manage. If your account is new, it will probably say verify contacts here instead. However, there'll be an arrow next to it, which you can then click and then click manage from there. Once we're in here, it will take you to the domain menu where we can then find name servers. So then we can change this to custom DNS. And then for name server one and two, we're gonna use the ones that Cloudflare has given us. So we have this one here, which we'll copy, and we'll put it in the first one. And then for the second one, we'll copy this one as well, and then paste that one in as well. We can then click the green check mark, and there we go, it has now saved. Then we'll want to come back to Cloudflare, then click done, and then you basically want to go through the rest of the setup. Once you have Cloudflare set up, you'll then be able to go to the DNS tab, and then you'll be able to add DNS records. And we also have some guides on configuring DNS, which I'll leave in the description. So anyway, hopefully you have enjoyed today's video. If you have, definitely leave a like and subscribe. And hopefully, I'll see you next time.